Matt Rempe is a mutant. Like, there's no other way to describe this kid. He's 21 years old. We're now in the era of post-9-11 NHL prize fighters, which is just insane. Tonight, and I can only show some of this, or else YouTube will take the video down. I will link to the full scrap down in the description. Rempe faced off against heavyweight Nicholas Delorier, and honestly, I thought he had a really good bout. I think, to be honest, had he not had his head stuck in his jersey at the end with Delorier technically getting the takedown, he would have gotten a clean win. The crazy thing about Rempe is that every time I hear people talk about him, he gets an inch taller. My dad's like, hey, you see this new guy in the Rangers? He's six foot eight. I talked to one of my buddies today. Oh, this guy in the Rangers, he's six foot nine. What I do know is that he has absolutely no fear, and my God, can he throw them. Long ass arms, mutant style. I mean, this dude has had a pretty incredible start to his NHL career. He's kind of like the Jack guy of the Rangers. His first NHL game was the Winter Classic. He touches the ice, gets in a scrap, doesn't touch the ice again. In his third game, he gets 15 minutes of ice time, lays what, to be honest, I thought was a clean hit. He's just tall as hell. Gets the misconduct, but no suspension. Then tonight, of course, not just the scrap we talked about, but he would actually score the game-winning goal. Shocker when you've got a dude who's 7'2 on the team, you put him in front of the net, the puck bounces off him because the goalie can't see anything, and you've got, of course, a goal scorer's goal. How they can get away with building a seven foot four bronze statue in the middle of the ice i don't know you'd think it'd be goaltender interference but when you've got a seven foot five player you've got to use them anyway the goal was originally credited to goudreau but rempy would get it and his post-game interview was just really awesome the dude is in love with being in the nhl you can tell i doubt he was expecting to score much i mean in the ahl he's got 22 points in 96 games but when you're seven foot five just being there hey you can make a difference. Right now, I mean, the Rangers are on a 10-game win streak. It ties them for longest in franchise history. And tomorrow, they can get that record against, guess who? The Columbus Blue Jackets. Hopefully not a trap game, but hey, we'll see. Anyway, guys, I think we're gonna have an awesome night for hockey. Let me know your thoughts on all the games, but especially this one, the goal, and the scrap down below.